All right, everyone, welcome back to another episode of Diablo 4. I'm Captain Beefy. This is the Game Vault, and we're going to be looking at yet another dungeon walkthrough today. This is the Defiled Catacomb, which is just a little bit east of Nevisk. And Nevisk is, there it is in relation to Kivashet. So you'll have to basically head down in a southwestern manner to get to this area and unlock this park part right here. Pretty easy trip down there. Uh, we get the aspect of uh, the tempering blow for the barbarian out of here. So let's cue up to music and we'll see what it's all about. Conveniently had a place set up so we can just travel here right away and go on inside and see what this is doing in here. We're also going to go through some of the, uh, no, not some of, but all of the uh, places you can capture the strongholds. Those will be fun to do. Those are always a little more exciting than the dungeons, but the dungeons are great, you know. Whether or not you have a barbarian, this is well worth doing. Pretty XP alone. Boom. Let's see how we hold up here. In fact, we need to take a potion. So, first thing we gotta do is kill everyone in this area. And they are conveniently marked with the little red dots. And that blow is sick. <laughs> Until that happens. Bust out our buddies real quick, let them finish it off. And we should have that death blow. Yep, it's back. What do we got here? Travel to the Spiral Crypts. I guess we killed everything already? Wow, that was short. And now we gotta destroy the skeletal constructs. Okay. Those spikes will hurt you. They'll make you vulnerable. And when you're vulnerable, you're almost as good as dead. Oh, crap. Alright. What is this? Only one of the better shrines. Make short work of bosses and pretty much everything else. Damn it. Executed. And we still got four of those skeletal constructs. Those are usually surrounded by... Yep. Go ahead and swirl here too. Do a little whirlwind. to the old whirlwind. We are vulnerable, so we gotta be careful. And that exploding poison, whenever you see that, you gotta run. That is horrible. We've had more misfires than not. 
go. Have at it, guys. Stun there for a second. Oops. Tried to get out of his way. <laughs> Stop picking up the spider. Did we run him through a wall? Oh no, that's an opening. All right, where do we stand? We got a nice broadsword here. Cool. Excellent. Still hanging in there pretty good. I think we had a treasure goblin I didn't even notice, but... Yeah. I don't think we're in a position to get one of them yet. I'm trapped in here by our ancestors' magic and the undead. Oh god, it's the butcher. We're dead. Oh, we made it. Okay, we're gonna have to go back in. That butcher, man, we are not ready for him. He'll freaking wipe us out. Now, he's not a part of that dungeon normally. The the butcher will randomly spawn in different dungeons and um, I believe cellars too, although I'm not sure if I saw him in the cellar yet. But that may have gotten rid of him. I'm not sure. I know if you die... He won't be there when you get back, so there's that at least. Why am I stuck? Alright, we gotta continue on our way down here. We still have two more of those constructs, and then we've got the next section of the dungeon to finish off, so you're right to it here. Yeah, that dungeon has ruined or that butcher has ruined more than one dungeon for me. Oh, he sucks. I don't know if, if any of you played the original Diablo. He was the boss. I'm pretty sure it was at the end of the very first level. He was brutal. Yeah, if you weren't geared up properly, you were in trouble with him. It's pretty much the same way now. If you're not ready, yeah, he will just smoke you. all that. Alright, let's back to the whirlwind.
to get a double boss fight here. Ow. Oh, the poison sucks. Man, he's a little too tough, huh? Oh, increased health, he is a minion. Gotta watch it, yeah. She's guys off. One more construct, and we should be coming up. To yep, there it is. Get these guys off. Don't get up. I said, don't get up. So now we need to slay the gatekeeper and collect the catacomb key. I imagine we're on the right route to doing that, so let's move forward. one all right well let's pop a potion and let's check our abilities real quick all right we do have the chance now to do one of these final ones right so we got berserk walking arsenal Unbridled Rage. Gushing Wounds. Now, the core skill is that. Whirlwind. Oh, yes. Okay, that's the one we're going to go for then. Alright, so they're going to do more damage, but it's going to use more Fury up. So now we need to worry about Fury Generation. And we can also check here and see if we have any upgrades we can use. There's one. Okay. All right, couple minor upgrades. Let's kill this guy. Let's check our whirlwind on him. Our whirlwind ran out fast. That was not good, but it did do quite a bit of damage, so. You know, it's got its uh, payoff there. Let's see if we gotta go this direction. It looks like this will be the way. Yep. So we got a boss to fight now. Well, this will be fun. Uh, Broodguard. Guard. <laughs> 
Alright, well we inflicted quite a bit of damage here. Oh, she keeps interrupting us. Why are we stuck? Ah. Again. And these guys will maybe finish it off. Yes. So that's it. The filed catacombs are done. You got to see the big nasty spider at the end. Wonderful. I hate spiders. Thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I'm Captain Beefy. This is the Game Vault. Please leave a like on the video down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, ring that bell for notifications. I'll see you guys next time. Until then, peace.